the highway. Call hell. This highway call hell. The Bible say broad is the way. And many there be that find it. The broad way call hell. I'm making this video to, to encourage somebody. If you are watching this video right now and you are a sinner, you have not accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord and as your Savior. You have not recognized Jesus Christ as become your God. You see him as a fallen angel. My friend, you are wrong. Because if you are on this way, that means that you, you are not born again. If you're on this way, that means that you're an unbeliever. If you're on this way, my friend, you're not accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord and as your Savior. This broad way called hell of those that have not accepted. Hey, glory to God, you have not believed. You have not seen, you have not confessed. And D, you are not delivered. Hey, glory to God, from your sin. And I'm making a video just to design for those that on this way call hell. You're on this way call hell because you think partying is the only way. You think drinking, you will drink yourself to delivery. You will smoke yourself. You're smoking a pack of cigarette or two pack or three pack of cigarette. And you think that that's your only hope of killing your problem. But this highway, you can get on this highway, my friend, and get on a highway called holiness. This highway is where the devil meet people that are despondent. People that have not accepted Jesus Christ as their Lord and as their Savior. Jesus Christ say, little Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ say, if you don't believe that I am here, you're going to die in your sin. And the Bible says the wage of sin is death, but the gift of God is, hallelujah, to, to them that accept Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior. Let me say this scripture again, my friend. The Bible says the wage of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Jesus Christ wants you to live. He's not, he's not willing that any shall perish, but all men, all men, all men, including women, to accept Jesus Christ as their, as their Savior and as their Christ. That woman was at the well. She was a sinner because she had she been married five times and the man she was with was not her husband. And she perceived that Jesus Christ was a prophet. She left her water pot and went to the city and told them, come see a man that tell me everything that I have done. Jesus Christ come that you may have life. Jesus Christ come to seek and to save which is lost. If you want to be free, my friend, the Bible says, and ye shall know the truth. You are a sinner. And you need a savior. And he's sovereign. Hallelujah. In a soon coming king. You ain't got to be on this highway. Get off this highway right now. If you are glory to God, need a prayer, let me pray for you right now. Hey, glory to God, you can go to my email address. That's Rome International 247 at gmail.com. That's R-O-A-M International. I-N-T-E-R-N-A-L. Glory to God National 247 at gmail.com. And I will pray for you. I will tell you, get off this highway. This highway, Satan and his demons, Lord, is come to torment you. Hey, glory to God, you ought to get off this highway. This highway is leading to hell. This highway of people that are drinking, people that are smoking, people that are living in sin, people that are shacking, people that are fornicating, people that are committing adultery, people that are lying, people that are stealing, people that are gossiping, people that are lukewarm, people that are one foot in the church and one foot in the house, in the house of God. This highway, my friend, hey, glory to God. They do all this work, but the Bible say, my friend, I never knew you. Don't be like the foolish virgin. They have a lamp and had no oil in their lamp. This highway, hey, glory to God. These people are lukewarm. These people are hypocrites. These people are, are pretending to be something which they are not. This highway, they call hell, are people that go to church, but the church ain't in them. This highway I'm talking about, you just go, you're a church goer, you're not a Christian. You're a goat and not a sheep. You're a wheat, you're a tear and not a wheat. 
I'm telling you right now, if you're on this highway, get off this highway, this highway leading to hell, this highway leading to destruction, this highway, my friend, Jesus Christ say, if you don't believe that I am here, you're going to die, you're going to damn in your sin. Hallelujah. The Bible says in Mark 16, verse 16, he that believeth and baptized shall be saved, but he that keep on, on this highway going to lead to destruction. Hey, glory to God. Listen to me, brothers and sisters. If you're on this highway, get off this highway while you have a chance. The Bible says in, in Proverbs 27, verse 1, boast up for tomorrow because we know not what tomorrow may bring. Don't brag. Don't brag about tomorrow. What you got to do, you got to do it now. The Bible says, save now. I beseech you, O Lord. Send prosperity now to the day of salvation. Today, you hear his voice. Hard not your heart. I'm blowing the trumpet. The Bible says, cry loud and spear not. Lift up that voice of the trumpet and show these people that's on the highway, there's a hell. The highway called hell. Who's in the highway, preacher? Hey, people that, that stride the fence. People that go to church and don't let the church go in them. Hey, go to, they are church goers. They are shouters. They are speaking in tongues, but they ain't living nothing that they're speaking about. I'm talking about the highway called hell. If you're on this highway, you ought to get off right now. Hey, go to get off right now. Get off. How you get off? I'm so glad you asked. Get off by repenting. Get off by repenting. Re get off by remembering, hey, glory to God, that God loves you. Re hallelujah. Repent right now. The Bible says, glory to God, repent. He shall likewise perish. Repent means to turn from your wicked ways. If you're on this highway, God wants you to repent. God wants you to remember. God wants you to return to him right now. Say, Father, come into my life right now. I'm a sinner. I need to be saved. I'm a sinner. I'm a wretch undone. Oh, glory to God. Say, Jesus, come into my life and save me right now. It's me. It's me, oh, Lord. Stand in need of prayer. I need you right now, oh, God. Save me, Lord. And God will save you. Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. Don't, don't think that you, your sin, hey, glory to God, you, your sin cannot be forgiven. The Bible says you're faithful and just. To forgive, to, to forgive us and to cleanse us from all, all unrighteousness. So if you're a homosexual, ask God to forgive you. If you're a lesbian, ask God come into your life. If you are, hallelujah, if you are shacking, go to God, ask God to give you a place, to provide a place for you so you can move out from this man and from this woman. If you are a shacking, yes, I'm talking about you live with a man or you live with a woman that's not your spouse. If you stop fornicating, fornicators is on this highway. If you're fornicating, my friend, you ought to ask God forgiveness, and God will forgive you. The Bible says, faithful and just to forgive us and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. How you get off the highway? You got to remember God. God wants you to remember him. The Bible says, remember that creator in the day of, of youth, why you say he has no pleasure in them. And next thing, you got to return to God. God married a backslider. If you are backslid, if you are backslidden from God, God say his arm is still stretched out. He says, stand at the door and knock. Well, you stand at the door and knock. The handle is on the inside. He's not going to break the door down. He's not going to jump in the car until it stop and pull over. No, he say, open the door. The door, the handle is on the inside. Hallelujah. He say, he say, hallelujah. He say, go to God. He stand at the door and knock. If any man hears voice, how you hear God's voice? You hear God's voice. How can you hear what a preacher and how can he preach except God? sent him. I'm telling you right now, get off the road, a highway called hell. You get off by repenting. You get off by remembering. You get off by returning back to God. God loves you, sister. God loves you, brother. Get off the road called hell. Hallelujah. The highway. What I say? The highway called hell. Hell. Hey, glory to God. Hell, my friend, is not a laughing matter. Hell is not no bad word. It's a bad destination. If you decide to go to hell, it's a choice that you have made. Hey, glory to God. But God loves you so much. The Bible says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believe on him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. The Bible says, My friend, glory, great love have no man than this, that a man lay down his life for his friends. You are my friends. If you do whatsoever, 
forever, I command you. I come and tell you, my friend, the highway called hell. God calling you, brother. God calling you, sister. Come. He said, come. He said, come unto me, all he that have laden, and I will give rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn of me. Because my yoke is easy and my burden is light. God wants you to come. God said, cast it all your kids upon him because he cared for you. Come, brother. Come, sister. Hey, glory to God. He said, cast it all. He said, some, all your, your kids, your anxiety, your stress, your worry, your situation, your hard thing, my friend. God said, cast it all your kids upon him because he cared for you. Oh, glory to God. The highway called hell. Oh, he said, cast your burden upon the Lord and he will sustain thee. Oh, glory to God. Right now, somebody, you need to come. Yes, you come, come, come. There's room at the cross. Yeah, come. I see your hand, brother. I see your hand, sister. Come. Yes, I see your hand. I see you. Yes, I see your hand. It, it's still room at the cross. There's still room. There's a room for, for, for 100 people, my friend. A million people. You need to come to Christ. Come to Christ right now. While you have an opportunity, while you're breathing the breath of life, you can say, Lord, forgive me. Lord, come into my life. Lord, save me right now. Lord, give me the Holy Ghost ghost right now. I need your Holy Ghost right now. Holy Ghost come into my life. Oh, glory to God. Peter, when Peter was preaching on their Pentecost, the men said, men and brethren, what must we do? And, and Peter said, repent and be baptized, every one of you, for remission of your sin. Hallelujah. Let me say that again. I want you to hear this, my friend. He said, repent, every one of you. Hallelujah. For the name of Jesus Christ, remission of your sins, and ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. He said, repent and be baptized, every one of you. In the name of Jesus Christ, for the remission of sin, and ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Nicodemus came to Jesus Christ by night. He said, Master, we know that thou art come from God. Can no man can do this miracle that thou doest, except God be with him. Jesus Christ said, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, as a man, man be born again, he can see the kingdom of God. Nicodemus said, how can a man, oh, glory to God, how can a man be born again? Shall he enter a second time in his mother's womb and be born again? Jesus Christ said, no, Nicodemus, verily, verily, I send thee as a man be born of the water, baptized. You must baptize. It's not no sprinkle. It's not no hose you down. You got to emerge in the water. You got to go down in the water. The Bible says, shall we continue to sin that grace may abound? God forbid, how shall we live any longer therein? I'm telling you, you got to emerge in the water. Baptize me death. Baptize me in merge of water. Hey, glory to God. And ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost and the Spirit of God. The Spirit of God is the Holy Ghost. The Holy Ghost is God. It's God coming in you and teaching you all things. The God coming in you and comforts you all things. The God coming in you and show you things to come to pass. The God called the Spirit the Holy Ghost. When the Holy Ghost comes, he will lead you and guide you into all truth. The Holy Ghost he said, you are sealed unto the day of redemption. I'm talking about the highway called hell. How you get off? By repenting, by remembering, and by returning to God. How oh, glory to God. It's time for somebody right now. There's somebody, I'm looking at somebody right now. There's 150,000 people. You know, you need to come. You need to get off this highway. You've been going to church for a long time. Yes, you've been going to church for a long time. You carry your Bible every turn. Oh, you, you, you speak in tongue. You shout the house down, but you're still, you're still fornicating. You're still stealing. You're still, hallelujah, gossiping. You're still lying. You're still stealing. You do all these things, my friend, but I thought you supposed to go to church. Oh, glory to God. Out of church, the hospital, yes, my friend. But if you don't accept Jesus Christ in your life, you'll still be the same. The highway, the highway, call hell. Hallelujah, hallelujah, somebody right now, somebody right now, you need to come right now, you need to come, you need to call, you need to put your hand on this, on the screen right now and say, Father, come into my life and save me, Father, come into my life and transform me, come into life and fill me with the gift of the Holy Ghost, I need a Holy Ghost right now, I need a Holy Ghost right now, oh, Father God, oh, God, forgive my sin, I'm a sinner, I need to be saved, I'm a sinner, oh, God, wash me white as snow, oh, Oh God, if you Bible say, oh God, the glory to God, as he will wash you white as snow. Come, let's reach together. Though your sin be a scarlet, let you white and snow. 
Come to Jesus, brother. Come to Jesus. Yes, I'm talking to you, brother. Come to Jesus. Oh, glory to God. This is not a white man religion. This is a whosoever will religion. This is not a religion. It's a relationship. He want a relationship from you. The highway. I say the highway called hell. Get off of it right now while you have an opportunity, while you breathe the breath of God. Why? I used to have a track call at last it comes straight now to come to church. My friend, if you're in a casket, it's too late. If you die, it's too late. If you're on a sick bed and you ain't glory to God, you're thinking about Jesus, it's too late. But now you're breathing the breath of life. You're watching the video and you say, what must I do to be saved? It's an A, B, C, D plan. A, you got to accept him. B, you got to believe him. C, confess him and D he will deliver you from your sin the highway call hell ha, I'm trying Thank you.